through Yorkshire Food. My name's Nigel Brown, and I'm going to be taking you on a journey of food adventure through Britain's biggest county, Yorkshire. Shall we make a start? Welcome to my greenhouse. Here we've got these fabulous bunches of grapes, which make really nice, nice wine, I'm hoping. Look at that, perfect. Round of applause, Caroline. Well done. This lobster's come all the way from sunny Bridlington yesterday. My brother lives in Bridlington. I said, right, I want a lobster. Bring one down. So he did. So who's who? <laughs> well, this is Granny Ramsden. Granny Ramsden. My mother. She's up till 1am this morning baking and pricing. I don't usually say this, but I'll try yours if you try mine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're here at the foot of the Humber Bridge, the gateway to Yorkshire's finest ingredients. We're going to be showing you some fabulous recipes using ingredients from Bridlington to Bradford. We're going to make a fabulous recipe today using some rhubarb, which is here. It's actually from Wakefield, and it's a rhubarb, ginger and tea tiramisu made with Yorkshire tea. We need to prepare our rhubarb. And really all we want is just this nice vibrant red. We're just slicing and dicing it down nice and small. We want it to cook nice and quickly. And that little bit of water just helps the rhubarb start to cook. Just a little stir. And into there we're going to put a little bit of vanilla and they'll just infuse in with the rhubarb as well. A little bit of ginger. And that is really... Oh, I could just have that on my toast. And into our tea we're going to add a little cheeky ingredient. Some raspberry liqueur. No one's looking. Put some biscuits down the base. Oh, or crumble them. The choice is yours. Rhubarb filling. And then once we've got the topping on, finish with a little icing sugar and cocoa powder. And then we're going to take some lovely fresh strawberries and they've got a really nice rhubarb, ginger and tea tiramisu. Along my journey I'll be discovering and sharing with you some of the best produce that Britain's biggest county has to offer. We're going to be going from tickling trout to landing lobsters to shooting our own game in season. I'll be leaving no stone unturned as I seek to find the very best produce to bring to your table. I'll be meeting some colourful Yorkshire characters along the way that have spent a proud lifetime producing their award-winning foods for our palates and plates. This is Tilly, my 1970s Austin Healy Sprite. Tilly's going to be taking us on our journey as we seek to find the finest ingredients from the land. I'll be rounding this series up with a fabulous True Yorkshire Food celebration dinner that will see me cooking for a hundred of the region's finest food producers on board the North Yorkshire Moors Railway's Pullman Diner as we journey by steam into the sunset across the North Yorkshire Moors. We're going to be doing everything we can possibly find with food from the biggest county in Britain, Yorkshire. So join us soon on True Yorkshire Food.